Okay, continuing from the previous video, there's a couple of things we want to do to further customize uh, that navbar we just created. So, the first we want to do is go over to the navigation controller and we're going to change the tint of that navigation controller to take it away from that default blue color. Let's go ahead and after clicking on the navigation controller we can select tint and change that to any color you want to. I'm going to pick green. And you notice that as you click on the other view controllers that uh, use that navigation controller, they'll also change the green as well. A second thing you want to do is add a title to that navigation bar. And I can just click on the navigation bar and then in the attributes inspector type in a title. Or I can click directly into the navigation bar as I'm doing in the second view and type it in there and you see the title will appear there as well. Now if I run it, you'll see that uh, my title appears, the navigation bar is green, and when I go to that second view controller, um, my second title appears, as well as that back button now has the name of the, the title that was in the previous view controller. Well, let's say I don't want that name to appear and I want to have some custom name appear in that back button. What I do is go to that first view controller and in the attributes inspector after clicking on the navigation bar I can change the back button title. And now when I run it you can see that the title for the back button is that 2-1 that I entered in the back button attribute for the navigation controller on the first view controller. Remember to do that on the first on the view controller you're coming from, not the view where the actual uh, button appears.